Blue green algae is important because it directly affects humans and human health and animals as well, I guess. But um, yeah, because it's in our drinking water supplies and it can bloom and, and produce toxins, um, it directly affects our water supplies and um, we need to know how to manage it and what to do about the situation when it's there. Yeah, it'll improve our knowledge of what's happening in the, in the systems at the moment and in comparing the, the Fitzroy, which is a flowing water system, to the storage dams as well, which are used in industry around central Queensland. So it'll improve our understanding of what's happening with blue-green algae and also um, how to manage it and how to predict it, that sort of thing. We've had a few blooms that have occurring this year, so we've gone out a little bit more often, twice, twice a month, and um, actually a couple more times than that. So depending on what we're finding, we're increasing the sampling time. It is actually a blue-green colour when it's blooming. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's where it gets its name. And yeah, there's slums and slicks that you can see on the surface of the water. It's just interesting to sort of look through the microscope and see what's there. It's amazing what you can find in, um, you know, in a couple of mils of water when you're testing it. I wanted to get um, a good background in, in this area because it's an important issue um, and sort of get my knowledge base up a bit with it. So, mm. yeah, I'll see where we go from there. After I left school, I did dabble in a couple of degrees and fell into hospitality and worked my way um, up through that and ended up um, doing function managing. So um, I found a really rewarding career that I took some time off to have children and decided that I sort of wanted to go and do something a bit more challenging. So um, yeah, science has always been my dream. It's always what I wanted to do. So yeah, CQ gave me the opportunity to to do it externally with the kids and then finish it off. So yeah, it's been great.